Hi guys, so in this video, a very small video, I'm going to teach you how to improve the brakes in a Yamaha Blaster. As you know, Yamaha Blaster, the early Yamaha Blasters came with a drum brake system. Yeah, like this. And where, where the brakes actuate is by a, a steel cable and by this lever and you press this and the... the um, the, the hub locks but as you may know this system is not very good actually it is awful so what are the um, the alternatives to improve the brakes from the Yamaha blaster as you may know some newer e uh, blasters came with uh, these brakes uh, in, in, the, in the system so one way to improve this is just to get some uh, used newer b blaster disc brake systems however there is a, a easier um, how can I say it's they are more rare the blasters that come with brake discs but there are a lot of Yamaha warriors in the market used parts for Yamaha warriors and also benches so what I use is that I, I, I was able to get uh, Yamaha Warrior 350 hubs and discs and disc calipers and so my idea and what I've read in the internet is that you can internet change these hubs and these spindles however they are not plug and play why? as you may see the top attachment for this spindle is not a conical uh, support, but this type of support, where it is, it is it's like this. This is the A arm, and this is attached here. And this A arm is like this. And the spindle from the Yamaha Warrior is conical, and we is locked with sorry this one locked with a nut. It's just like the uh, under support on the uh, trailing arms on the blaster. So you need both these both systems of uh, conical up and down with a nut here. So what is the, the, the option? It's very easy actually. You have this type of uh, ball joint, sorry, this is the term, ball joint here on the blaster but this is just welded with some spot welds almost so I use the angle grinder to cut this and remove this ball joint type so this is not necessary and now the next step is just to get a ball joint with a conical and a, um, a nut and this is very easy to find because there are a lot of um, uh, uh, quads that use a ball joint of this type but with conical and a nut type. I'm going to put on the description the, the, a link for the part and I'm going to show you how to put back that type of joint. This is the part I ordered. It's a ball joint, as you can see it's very similar from the original one that comes in the blaster but has some uh, nut to be used on the Warrior disc brakes. As you can see it fits perfectly on the Warrior disc brakes and also it fits on the A-arm of the Yamaha blaster. What is left to do is just weld it this in place.
that's it. A blaster, suspension system. Actually, this is not in a blaster, as you know, but it works with the warrior spindles and the warrior discs.